As inflation continues to hit the Nigerian economy, affecting almost every sector of the economy and business in the country, some local shoemakers who spoke with BTV News decried the hike in the price of raw materials in the markets, saying that the cost of materials rose by 100% in the last quarter of 2023, and it has affected production capacity, sales, as well as the price of locally made shoes in the states. The respondents called on the government to intervene and check the inflation in the country as they are almost losing their source of living. This time around, materials are very costly. That's one of the major challenges we are having now. So if you buy something today of a, a 2,000 naira, tomorrow they will tell you it's 2,500. Next tomorrow they will tell you it's 3,000. We'll have that, that uh, challenge. That one is one of the major challenges you have now. And uh, at the same time, you know, customers, because of uh, the fund, the, the money that is not uh, uh, circulating. So if you do work for them to come and collect it, it would be a problem. Then you will not have uh, your own uh, to feed your uh, family. Before, before, I feed about 150 I can for one liter. So that one, that one uh, liter could carry me for two to three days. But now this, fuel is 600. So I cannot buy fuel where it could carry me three days for my gen. Now uh, for light, we would uh, use, they, they bring us to, to they charge of 3,000 that I pay for a month. So the bill is too high. So we cannot uh, afford, afford it. So I want government to bring the price of everything. Other respondents called on the government at all levels and other critical stakeholders in the country to support the production of locally made shoes as it will create employment opportunities and boost the Nigerian economy. The respondents urged local shoe manufacturers proud of their product by inscribing Made in Nigeria on it saying it will further stimulate the growth in the shoe-making industry. The truth is, a lot of us are actually shy of selling these products. Especially, that's why you see that some persons will get shoes, make shoes, but they will not put made in Nigeria because people talk down on it as in, you're wearing made in Nigeria, how do you say, how do you, as in, someone can see a very beautiful shoe. Then when you say, ah, where did you get this shoe from? He'll tell you, ah, I got it in Nigeria, and he'll just lose interest. So it's that kind of thing. But if we can push our products here, push it to other persons, it will be, let, let it be in the face of other international or foreigners, it will, also, it will help us a lot. And it's something that they can really invest on. It will help the economy of the country very well. If the government is able to bring students here, maybe after school, or just for them to learn something. Because if you look at this day and age now, it's going, the way things are going is into handworks. That's, how, that's where the country is now. You have to be able to learn a skill. And the government should be able to bring students, maybe after schools, at least an hour or two would be enough for them to learn a thing or two from here. And it will go a long way in pushing the economy. All the respondents were of the opinion that the inflation in the country is negatively affecting all businesses. They called on the government to intervene and improve the economy for the betterment of all Nigerians. Gloria Afajibi. Reporting for BTV News.